Hey, Shalom, Shalom Israel. First and foremost, we like to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bashem Yahweh Kodash, to the honors to the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone. Shalom to you, brothers in the highways and the byways, preaching and teaching this word in sincerity and in truth. Now, this is your brother Shapal from the GMS Jamaica camp, and now with a quick lesson. And I say quick, so I really want to make this a very quick one because, you know, just getting to the point, you know, with us one brothers for, you know, just focus on the point that has been said, man. And, you know, not too much rambling, you know, but just to the point. And this lesson is based around what is happening now, what is about to come, and our trials and tribulation, all right? So as we're on the screen, we see on the screen here is a, is a um, you know, oftentimes we go through social media and we see some things, you know, and um, my brother had this up on his status. You know, it, it trust me, it's very spiritual. It's a, always remember this. Grapes must be grapes must be crushed to make wine. Diamonds, right? Um, diamonds formed under pressure. Olives are pressed to release oil. Seeds grow in darkness, right? Whenever you feel crushed, under pressure, right? Pressed or in darkness. You are in a powerful place of transformation. Trust the process. All right? See, and trust me, it's spiritual. Because what I want you to do is exalt by the Spirit to let them know that, look, whatsoever we're facing now, we're facing it now because the times to come, all right, is going to be more hectic. You know, it's going to be more, more, more dangerous, man. All right? All right? And all of this is a test. Nevertheless, man, we are we are we are facing oppression now because there's a reason. Alright? So first scripture I want to get. Alright. The first scripture I want to get is the um first Corinthians um eleven and verse thirty thirty two. Start verse thirty two. So but when we are judged, we are chastened of the Lord, right? That we should not be condemned with the world, right? See, because look, the scripture, man, is, is very spiritual and is very powerful. You know, when Yahweh Shai comes, man, look, the world is going to be judged wickedly, dangerously, man, right? See, the Lord is coming back with wrath pour out his wrath upon this society wickedly, evilly uh, trust me you know, the Lord is going to go make this place hell you know but guess what we as men of the Lord man, the reason why we are facing this now right, Lord's will be a part of the elect, you know is because in the time to come, right, we are not going to be judged with the world man, right the world, the Lord is going to judge the world, right? So the Lord is judging his elect and getting us ready and purging us. See? Because that's why the Yahweh Shai died, man. When he, when he, 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 um, he came right, to the poor and spirit of the Most High, right? He came to shed his blood for the elect of the nation of Israel. All right? See? So the elect, no matter what, the elect is not for Esau, to be chipped. Remember, let's put that out there, man. The elect is not for Esau to be chipped. The elect doesn't belong to Esau. Yahushai paid, right, his blood for the elect. So the elect is not going to be chipped. The thing is, who is a part of the elect? And that's what, you know what I mean, is, is the whole mystery. You know? See? So the Lord is getting men ready, man, right? And purging. Right? And chasing us daily. Right now in our lives. Whether it be monetarily, whether it be woman, whether it be this um illness, turns in the flesh, you know, a sort of sickness, you know, stress and whatever it may be, man. Right? Because you're getting judged. Right? And when the Lord comes, right, you are not gonna be judged with the world. Their judgment is gonna be different. And that's why every day we face a lot of things. All right, another scripture, right? To solidify the point, this is 
Luke 6 and verse 20, it says, we start at verse 20, and he lift up his eyes, um, like, and, he lift, and he lift up his eyes and his disciples and said, Blessed be ye poor, blessed be ye poor, for yours is the kingdom of God. All right, verse 21. Blessed are ye that hunger, that hunger know, for ye shall be filled. Blessed are, are, are ye that weep now, for ye shall laugh. Right? So we face all of these things because guess what? It's in the time when the Lord begins to judge this society, we are going to be the ones that are laughing. That's right? We're going to be the ones that are rejoicing. We're going to be the ones that are filled. So you now we will face our chastisement now. Right? And we, yeah, we wall it, you know, and that's what I'm saying to brothers, man. Look, hold on, man, because it is for a reason. As the as the um the quote where everyone screams, say what? Trust the process, you know. Trust the process, man. All right. So when we know is being chastised and and you know hunger and whatever it may be, which the Lord not gonna leave you starving, in other time to come, right? Because we see many um many um incidents in the scriptures right wherein the lord feed his, his, his disciples man all right see so we know where we're going to be protected in that time right and this is what lord has said man, because these words are words of comfort right right so it's a blessed are ye that hunger now for ye shall be filled blessed are ye that weep now right for ye shall laugh blessed are ye when men shall hate you and when they separate you from their company, right? And shall reproach you and cast you out, so like and cast out your names as evil for the Son of Man's sake. I right? say, so rejoice ye in that day, right? And leap for joy, for behold, your reward is great in heaven, for in, right? It's like a, for in the like manner did they. It's like I did their um, fathers unto the prophets, you know. So this happened to our forefathers, man, and we are no greater, you know, than the prophets. You know, a matter of fact, we are our forefathers if we can receive in the, in the reincarnation, in the regeneration, man, right? And it goes on to show you that, you know, um, these men, the rich men in a society, and, you know, we cannot go two more verses down, just to show you the opposite, right? It's about woe unto you. This verse 24 that are rich, for ye have received your constellation. Woe unto you that are full, for ye shall be hunger. Hung it's for ye shall hunger. Woe unto you that laugh now, for ye shall mourn later. So that's the opposite. Right? Another verse down says, Woe unto you when men shall speak well of you, for so did their fathers <laughs> to the false prophet. All right, so now we're in a, the, 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 the period where we're not being speaking well of, you know, you know, we are, we are, we are hungry now, you know, and a lot of things happen to us now, we are in some other time before entering the truth, these things have never happened to us, because we have set our foot to the plow, and we are sons of the Lord, the Lord of chastisement, because scripture even say, um, every son will the Lord get his cogit, and if you are not getting chastened, then you are not a son of the Heavenly Father. So at the end of the day, we are getting beaten every day because in other time where the Lord, because we can see now, where the Lord is going to make him entrance. A lot of things happening now. And in that time to come, look, we are going to be protected, man, because a lot of these things we're speaking, the, 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 the scripture we just read a while ago, is being fulfilled on us today, man, as men of the Lord. Because we know a lot of brothers diligently doing the truth of Yahweh, and he's being and a law, you know, saying, so we know that when the wicked days, the evil days about to come in the Lord, about to judge this world, right, then we know, I will see the, 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 the opposite, the side has been flipped, so there's no need for worry, Akim, in other time to come, right, there's no need for worry, man, for as long as you're doing this truth, you know, in a pureness and, and in, in the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahushim and giving your, your, your body as a living sacrifice, then the Lord, the Lord will protect you through that time, you know. 
See? So, for all of that came out there, we're doing this truth in sincerity, man. You know? Let's know that, look, the reason why we're being chastised now, and this is because we're not going to be judged with the world. We're receiving our judgment now. There's a different judgment coming for two thirds of our people, and we're not going to be a part of it. Lord's will, Lord's will will continue to the end and are numbered among the elect of the Haubashi Shai. Right? So, brothers, just, you know, let that sink in and just keep doing the work, man. So, with that, we want to say all praises, honor, and glory to the Haubashi Shai. Bashem Rakal Kadash, to be honest to the elders and the apostles of Great Stone, Shalom to you, brothers in the highways and the byways, preaching and teaching this truth in sincerity. Shalom.